We begin with the discovery of Gobekli Tepe in year 1994, the oldest known temple in the world, 7,000 years older than Stonehenge. The rediscovery and initial recognition of Gobekli Tepe by German archaeologist Klaus Schmidt occurred in 1994. Who were these people building monuments before agriculture fully took off? Scholars now muse that the Gobekli Tepe's pillars may align with celestial bodies, hinting at prehistoric sky watching over 11,000 years ago. And in 2021, scientists uncovered matching symbols between Gobekli Tepe and symbols etched in stone at Karahan Tepe, whispering of a vast and veiled rite that bound these ancients in thought though time knew them not. Then let's go deep into the next discovery which is the, the Denisovans, Denisova Cave, Siberia in year 2010. Before 2017, archaeologists could only confirm ancient human presence if they found bones or tools, but with sediment DNA analysis, scientists discovered genetic traces of ancient hominins left behind in the very soil, from skin cells, hair, bodily fluids. It widens the archaeological lens, offering a more complete timeline of who lived where and when. DNA from Neanderthals, Denisovans, and early modern humans was found in the same cave layers, revealing that they all occupied the cave at different times and occasionally overlapped, especially around 45,000 years ago. Hybrid girl called Denny, with a Neanderthal mother and Denisovan father, the first direct evidence of interbreeding between species. Next, the third discovery we are talking about is Cosmic Microwave Background, CMB by Arno Penzias and Robert Wilson at Bell Labs in Holmdel, New Jersey in 1995. The discovery of CMB was so significant that Penzias and Wilson were awarded the Nobel Prize in Physics in 1978. Imagine this. The CMB is like a baby picture of the universe, showing what it was like just 380,000 years after it began. This helped prove the Big Bang really happened and allowed scientists to measure the universe's age, shape, and what it's made of. The Holmdel Horn Antenna, where the discovery was made, is now a National Historic Landmark. After that, the discovery is Indus Valley Sewer System in Mohenjo-Daro, Pakistan on 1922. Ancient plumbing more advanced than medieval Europe. A sophisticated urban sanitation system, including covered brick-lined drainage channels, public and private toilets connected to drains. This dates back to circa 2500 BCE, even predates Roman and medieval European plumbing by millennia. The fifth discovery, Fossil of Spinosaurus in Egypt. The first fossil of Spinosaurus was discovered in 1912 in the Baharia oasis of Egypt by Austrian fossil collector Richard Markgraf. The measurements suggested that Spinosaurus was even larger than T-Rex, making it the largest terrestrial carnivore then known lengths of 49-59 feet and weights of 6-9 tons. Major new fossils from 2014 to 2020 in Morocco's Kem Kem beds, revealed by paleontologist Nizar Ibrahim and his team found that Spinosaurus had adaptations for a semi-aquatic lifestyle. Unlike T-Rex or other carnivores it likely hunted fish, the only known swimming dinosaur. What else is lurking in Earth's fossil memory? And last discovery, human brain-to-brain -brain communication in 2014. The experiment involved a sender in India and receivers in France separated by about 5,000 miles. In 2014 across 5,000 miles of earth and sea, a thought leapt from one mind in India to another in France. No words, no wires, just pure brain to brain. It was no fantasy but science. The first direct, non-invasive communion of minds across distance is telepathy still fiction? Or is the future whispering back? Since 2014, that first silent signal sparked a decade of breakthroughs, from brain-controlled prosthetics to Neuralink's brain chip trials, and even paralyzed patients typing with thought alone, inching us ever closer to thought-powered communication. If you love scientific discoveries and hidden history, like and subscribe to Aaron Est, Tuck, Cursed, Tomb Found, or Victim or Villain, click to follow my channel. Thanks for watching.